Today we're looking into how and why you might want to change your section types in Scrivener 3 for Windows. However, I would suggest you watch the upcoming videos on section layouts before doing any of these things. So let's go to our custom metadata in the inspector and click on Edit in the Section Types list and look at the Section Types tab. Here you have a list of all the section types in this template. Now, before we start, the first thing to remember about these is that by themselves, they are not a format. There are no settings to change in a section type. They are just a way of defining what's what. The first reason you might want to change these is simply to make the names of the section types more meaningful to you. You can simply double click on the name and edit it. The other thing you can do is use the plus and minus buttons to add or delete specific section types. I wouldn't delete anything until you've understood section layouts properly, but you could certainly add your own. This is more likely to be necessary if you're writing non-fiction, which might have more unique required layouts than your average novel. Another thing you might want to do is swap which section types are applied. All you do is click on the folder and select the new section type from the list. Alternatively, if you want to change multiple binder items, select them with Ctrl and Shift. Right click and use section type from here. Next time we'll look at the different formats you have available to you in Compile. 